Once upon a time, in the magical land of Oz, there lived a young girl named Dorothy. She lived on a small farm in Kansas with her Aunt Em and Uncle Henry. Dorothy was a dreamer, always longing for something more exciting and adventurous than her quiet life on the farm. One day, a terrible tornado swept across the land, and Dorothy found herself caught in its path. As the wind howled and the house spun through the air, Dorothy held onto a nearby pole for dear life. When the chaos finally subsided, she opened her eyes to find herself in a completely unfamiliar place. Dorothy had landed in the colorful and extraordinary land of Oz. But her house had unfortunately landed on the Wicked Witch of the East, who had been terrorizing the Munchkins. As a result, the Grateful Munchkins celebrated Dorothy's arrival and hailed her as a hero. The Good Witch of the North appeared before Dorothy and told her that the only way to return home was to seek the help of the legendary Wizard of Oz, who resided in the Emerald City. Dorothy embarked on a journey along the Yellow Brick Road, hoping to find the wizard and ask for his assistance. Along her way, she encountered three companions who also sought the wizard's help. The first was the Scarecrow, who longed for a brain, believing he lacked intelligence. The second was the Tin Man, who wished for a heart, believing he had lost his ability to love. And the third was the Cowardly Lion, who desired courage, thinking he was a fearful beast. Together, they faced numerous challenges and dangers, including the Wicked Witch of the West, who sought revenge for her sister's demise. With each trial, Dorothy and her friends grew closer and learned valuable lessons about themselves and their desires. Finally, they reached the Emerald City and stood before the mighty Wizard of Oz. The wizard promised to fulfill their wishes if they brought him the broomstick of the Wicked Witch of the West. Determined to return home, Dorothy and her friends embarked on their most perilous adventure yet. Through their bravery and teamwork, Dorothy and her companions defeated the Wicked Witch of the West and retrieved her broomstick. But when they returned to the wizard, they discovered that he was not a real wizard at all but a humbug who relied on smoke and mirrors to appear powerful. Nevertheless, the wizard bestowed upon each of them what they desired, revealing that they had possessed these qualities all along. Dorothy realized that the ruby slippers, which she had acquired upon her arrival in Oz, had the power to take her back home. With a tearful farewell to her newfound friends, Dorothy clicked her heels three times and repeated, there's no place like home. In an instant, she found herself back in Kansas, surrounded by her beloved Aunt Em and Uncle Henry. Though she was glad to be home, Dorothy never forgot her adventures in the land of Oz and the friends she had made. She cherished the lessons she had learned and carried the magic of Oz in her heart forever.